Hi guys, so for this video I'm using yarn in size 2 and a crochet hook in size 3.25 millimeters. So I'll start by making a slip knot and then I will chain 8. So now that I've chain 8 on the last chain from a hook, I'll make a slip stitch. Now for row 1, I'll chain 3, then right there through that same loop, I'll make 24 double crochet. This 3 chain already counts as 1. So now to finish row 1, right here to this third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 1. Now for row 2, I'll chain 4, then through that same chain I'll make uh, 1 double crochet. I'll chain 3, now skip the next two chains and through this third chain I'll make one double crochet, chain one, then through that same chain I'll make one double crochet. Again I'll chain three. I'll skip the next two chains and through this third chain I'll make one double crochet. Chain one and through that same chain I'll make one double crochet. Again I'll chain three. I'll skip the next two chains and through this third chain I'll make one double crochet. Chain one and then through that same chain I'll make one double crochet. So I'll repeat this throughout row two and by the end of row two we should have eight V stitches with three chains in between. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now to finish row two, I'll chain three, then right here through this third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row two. Now for row three, right here through this one chain loop, I'll make a slip stitch. I'll chain three. Now through that same one chain loop, I'll make one double crochet chain one, then through that same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet. Chain one, now through his next three chain loop I'll make one single crochet. Chain one, through his next one chain loop I'll make two double crochet. Chain one, then through that same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet.
chain one through his next three chain loop I'll make one single crochet chain one through his next one chain loop I'll make two double crochet chain one then through that same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet chain one through his next three chain loop I'll make one single crochet chain one through his next one chain loop I'll make two double crochet chain one then through the same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet so we repeat this throughout row three now to finish row three I'll chain one then right here through his third chain I'll make a slip stitch so this completes row three now for row four right here through his next double crochet chain I'll make a slip stitch through his next one chain loop one slip stitch then I'll chain three now through that same one chain loop I'll make one double crochet I'll chain one then through that same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet now I'll chain three through this next single crochet chain I'll make uh, one single crochet chain three through this next one chain loop I'll make two double crochet chain one then through that same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet chain three now through this next single crochet chain I'll make one single crochet chain three now through this next one chain loop I'll make two double crochet chain one then through that same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet chain three through his next single crochet chain I'll make one single crochet chain three through his next one chain loop I'll make two double crochet chain one then through that same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet so this so we repeat this throughout row four now to finish row four I'll chain three then right here through this third chain I'll make a slip stitch so this completes row four now for row five right here through this next double crochet chain I'll make a slip stitch through this one chain loop I'll make one slip stitch then I'll chain three now through that same one chain loop I'll make one double crochet chain one then through that same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet chain five through this next single crochet chain I'll make one single crochet chain five through this next one chain loop I'll make two double crochet I'll chain one then through that same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet chain five through this next single crochet chain I'll make one single crochet chain five through this next one chain loop I'll make two double crochet chain one then through that same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet chain five through this next single crochet chain I'll make one single crochet chain five through this next one chain loop I'll make two double crochet chain one then through the same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet so I'll repeat this throughout row five now to finish row five I'll chain five 
Then right here through a started chain, I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 5. Now for row 6, through this next double crochet chain, I'll make a slip stitch. Through this next one chain loop, I'll make a slip stitch. Chain 3, then through the same one chain loop, I'll make one double crochet. Chain 1, then through the same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. Now I'll chain 7, then through the next single crochet chain, I'll make one single crochet. Chain 7, through the next one chain loop, I'll make uh, two double crochet. Chain 1, then through the same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. Again, I'll chain 7. Through the next single crochet chain, I'll make one single crochet. Chain 7. Through the next one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. Chain 1, then through the same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. Now, so now I'll repeat this throughout row 6. Now to finish row 6, I'll chain 7. Now right here through this third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 6. Now for row 7, right here through this next double crochet chain, I will make a slip stitch. Through the next one chain loop, I'll make a slip stitch. I'll chain three, then through the same one chain loop, I'll make one double crochet. I'll chain one, then through the same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. I'll chain eight. Through the next single crochet chain, I'll make one single crochet. Chain 8. Through this next one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. Chain 1. And through the same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. Again, I'll chain 8. Through this next single crochet chain, I'll make one single crochet, chain 8. Through this next one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet, chain 1, and through the same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. So I'll repeat this throughout row 7. Now to finish row 7, I will chain 8. Now right here through this third chain, I will make a slip stitch. So this completes row 8. Now for row 9, through this next double crochet chain, I will make a slip stitch. Now through this one chain loop, I will make a slip stitch. Now I will chain 3. Then through the same one chain loop, I'll make one double crochet. I'll chain one. Then through the same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. Now I'll chain nine. Through this next single crochet chain, I'll make one single crochet. Chain nine. Through this next one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. Chain one, then through the same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. Chain two, then through 
chain 9 through this next once through this next single crochet chain I'll make one single crochet again chain 9 then through this next one chain loop I'll make two double crochet chain one then through the same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet so we repeat this throughout row eight to finish row eight I'll chain nine Now to this third chain I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 8. Now for row 9 through this next double crochet chain I'll make a slip stitch. Through this next one chain loop I'll make a slip stitch. I'll chain 3 and this is row 9. Now through the same one chain loop I'll make one double crochet. I'll chain 1 then through the same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet. Now I'll chain 10, now through this next single crochet chain I'll make one single crochet, again I'll chain 10, through this next one chain loop I'll make two double crochet, chain one then through the same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet chain ten then through this next single crochet chain I'll make one single crochet chain ten through this next one chain loop I'll make two double crochet I'll chain one then through the same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet. So I'll repeat this throughout row nine. Now to finish row nine I will chain ten. And right here through this third chain I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 9. Now for row 10 through this next double crochet chain I'll make a slip stitch. Through this next one chain loop I'll make a slip stitch. Now I'll chain 3 then through that same one chain loop I'll make one double crochet. Chain 1 through that same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet. chain 11 through this next single crochet chain I'll make one single crochet chain 11 through this next one chain loop I'll make two double crochet chain one through the same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet chain eleven through this next single crochet chain I'll make one single crochet chain eleven Through this next one chain loop I'll make two double crochet. Chain one and through the same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet. So we repeat this throughout row 10. Now to finish row 10 I'll chain 11 then right here through this third chain I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 10. 
Now to finish row 10, I will chain 11, then right here to a third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 10. Now for row 11, through this next double crochet chain, I'll make a slip stitch. Through this next one chain loop, I'll make a slip stitch. Then I'll chain 3. Through that same one chain loop, I'll make one double crochet. Chain 1. Then through that same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. I'll chain 13. Through this next single crochet chain, I'll make one single crochet, chain 13, through this next one chain loop, I'll make uh, two double crochet, chain one, then through the same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. Chain 13, through this next single crochet chain, I'll make one single crochet, chain 13, through this next one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. Chain one, then through the same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. So we repeat this throughout row eleven. So now to finish row eleven, I'll chain thirteen, then right here to this third chain, I will make a slip stitch. Now I'll chain one, then I'll cut this yarn. So this completes row 11. Now I'm going to use yarn a different color. Uh, honestly, I kind of have to buy some yarn pretty soon. Because it seems like I don't have enough of any of these yarns. Let's try this one. So now for row 12, I'm using yarn in different color. Let me just weave these ends in very quickly because, well, it's just one. Well, this project is actually quite large. I really like how it looks. And I hope you guys will like it just as much as I do. Good. So for row 12 now, right here through this first one chain loop, I insert my hook, then I insert my hook through a slip knot loop and pull through. Now I'll chain one, then right there through the same one chain loop, I'll make one single crochet. Now I will chain 25. So now that we chain 25, through this next one chain loop, I'll make one single crochet. Again, I'll chain 25. And through this next one chain loop, I'll make one single crochet. So you see, for row 25, we are just uh, chaining 25, and through every one chain loop, we're making one single crochet. To finish row 12, I'll chain 25, and right here through this single crochet chain, I'll make a slip stitch. 
So this completes row 12. Now for row 13, I will chain 3. And now through this next 25 chains, I'll make one double crochet through each chain. So this time around, we cannot work only through the 20 chain loop. We actually have to work through each chain. I know, I know, it's so much easier when you just work in the loop. Now right here through the single crochet chain, I'll make one double crochet. So we repeat this throughout row 13. Remember, through a single crochet chain, we make one double crochet. Then through these next 25 chains, we make one double crochet through each chain. Then again, through this next single crochet chain, we make one double crochet. So, so we repeat this throughout row 13. Now to finish row 13, right here through this third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 13. Now for row 14, I'll chain three. Through this next chain, I'll make one double crochet. Through the next chain, I'll make one double crochet. Through the next chain, one double crochet through the next chain, one double crochet. So for row 14, I'll just continue making one double crochet through each chain throughout row 14. Yeah, so we just continue making one double crochet through each chain. Now to finish row 14, right here through this third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 14. Now for row 15, I'll chain 5. Then I'll skip one chain into the second chain, I'll make one double crochet. I'll chain 2. I'll skip one chain into the second chain, I'll make one double crochet. Chain 2. Skip one chain into the second chain, I'll make one double crochet. Chain 2. Skip one chain into the second chain, I'll make one double crochet. So I'll repeat this throughout row 15. We chain two, skip one chain into the second chain, we make one double crochet. So now to finish row 15, I'll chain two, I'll skip one chain, then right here through this third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 15. Now for row 16, right here through this first two chain loop, I'll make a slip stitch. Then I'll chain three. Now right here through the same two chain loop, I'll make one double crochet. I'll chain one, then through the same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. Now I'll chain two. I'll skip this next what two chain loop and through this second two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster. I'll 
chain 2 through his next 2 chain loop I'll make 3 double crochet cluster chain 2 through his next 2 chain loop I'll make 3 double crochet cluster chain 2 through his next 2 chain loop I'll make uh, 3 double crochet cluster we need to repeat this until we have 11 sets of 3 double crochet clusters with 2 chains in between One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleven. Chain two. I'll skip his next two chain loop and through his second two chain loop I'll make two double crochet. Chain one, then through the same two chain loop I'll make two double crochet. Chain two, I'll skip his next two chain loop and through his second two chain loop I'll make uh, three double crochet. So you see, we repeat this throughout row 16. See here we have a, a V-stitch, we chain 2, we skip the first 2 chain loop, then through his next 11 2 chain loops we'll make uh, 11 3 double crochet clusters with 2 chains in between, then again we we'll chain 2, skip the next 2 chain loop and through his second 2 chain loop we'll make a V-stitch. So, and then we just repeat. So we repeat this throughout row 16. Now to finish row 16, I'll chain 2, then I'll skip this next 2 chain loop, and then right here to this third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 16. Now for row 17, right here to this next double crochet chain, I'll make a slip stitch. Through his next one chain loop, I'll make a slip stitch. I will chain three. Then through that same one chain loop, I'll make one double crochet. Chain one, and through the same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. Now I'll chain four. Now I'll skip this first two chain loop, and through the second two chain loop, I'll make a three double crochet cluster. Chain two through his next two chain loop. I'll make two double crochet. Through his next three. Through his next two chain loop. I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain two through his next two chain loop. I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain two through his next two chain loop. I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain two through his next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster. Through 
So it's next to oh yeah. Chain two, through his next two chain loop, I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain two, through his next two chain loop, I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain two, through his next two chain loop, I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain two through his next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain two through his next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain two now skip his next two chain loop and through his one chain loop right here through the shell I'll make two double crochet. Chain one, then through the same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. See one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So here for row seventeen, we have a V stitch with one chain in between. We chain two, we make ten three double crochet clusters with two chains in between. Again, we chain two, then we make a V stitch through this next V stitch with one chain in between. So we repeat this throughout row 17. So now to finish row 17, I'll chain two, and right here through this third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 17. Now for row 18, through this next double crochet chain, I'll make a slip stitch. Through this one chain loop, I'll make a slip stitch. Then I'll chain three. Through the same one chain loop, I'll make one double crochet. Chain one. Then through the same chain, I'll make two double crochet. Again, now I'll chain six. Now through this second, now skip this first loop and through this two chain loop right here, I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain two. Through the next two chain loop, I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain two. Through the next three chain loop, I'll make through the next two chain loop, I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain two. Through the next two chain loop, I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain two. Through the next two chain loop, I'll make uh, three double crochet cluster. Chain two. Through his next two chain loop, I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain two. Through his next two chain loop, I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain two. Through his next two chain loop, I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain two. Through his next two chain loop, I'll make three double crochet cluster. Now I'll chain six. Now I'll skip this first loop and through this one chain loop, ready to red shell, I'll make two double crochet. Chain one, then through that same loop, I'll make two double crochet. So we repeat this throughout row 18. So now to finish row 18, I'll chain six, then right here through this third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 18. Now for row 19, through this next double crochet chain, I'll make a slip stitch. Through this one chain loop, I'll make a slip stitch. Then I'll chain three, then through the same one chain loop I'll make one double crochet. I'll chain one, then through the same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet. Now I'll chain eight. Now through the next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain two, through this next two chain loop, I'll make three double crochet cluster. 
chain 2 through the next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster chain 2 through this next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster chain 2 through this next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster chain 2 through the next two chain loop I'll make uh, three double crochet cluster chain 2 through this next two chain loop I'll make uh, three double crochet cluster chain 2 through this next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster Now I'll chain 8 Then through this next one chain loop, right there through the shell, I'll make 2 double crochet Chain 1, then through the same one chain loop, I'll make 2 double crochet So I'll repeat this throughout row 19. To finish row 19, I'll chain 8, then right here through this third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 19. Now, now for row 20, through this next double crochet chain, I'll make a slip stitch. Through this one chain loop, one slip stitch, then I'll chain three. Now through that same one chain loop, I'll make one double crochet. Chain one, then through that same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. Now I'll chain ten. Then right here through this next two chain loop, I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain 2, then through the next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain 2, through this next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain 2, through this next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain 2, through this next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain 2, through this next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain 2, through this next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain 10 Now through this next one chain loop I'll make two double crochet Chain 1 and through the same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet So, so I repeat this throughout row 20. Now to finish row 20, I'll chain 10, then right here to this third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 20. Now for row 21, through this next double crochet chain, I'll make a slip stitch. Through this next one chain loop, one slip stitch. Then I'll chain three. Then through that same one chain loop, I'll make one double crochet. Chain one. Then through that same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. 
now I would say 14 now through this next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster I'll chain two then through this next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster chain two through this next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster chain two through this next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster chain two through this next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster chain two through this next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster again I'll chain 14 then through this next one chain loop right at red shell I'll make two double crochet chain one then through that same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet so I'll repeat this throughout row 21 now to finish row 21 I'll chain 14 then right here to the third chain I'll make a slip stitch so this completes row 21 now for row 22 through this next double crochet chain I'll make a slip stitch through this next one chain loop I'll make a slip stitch now I'll chain 3 and this is row 22 through that one chain loop I'll make one double crochet chain 1 then through that same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet chain 17 Now, through this next two chain loop, I'll make a three double crochet cluster. I'll chain two, then through that same two chain loop, I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain two, through the next two chain loop, I'll make three double crochet cluster. chain two through the next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster chain two through the next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster now I'll chain 17 Now through this next one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. Chain one, then through that same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. So I'll repeat this throughout row 22. Now to finish row now to finish row 22, I'll chain 17, then right here to the third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 22. Now for row 23, through this next double crochet chain, I'll make a slip stitch. Through this next one chain loop, I'll make a slip stitch. Then I'll chain 3. Now through that same one chain loop, I'll make one double crochet. I'll chain 1, then through that same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. I'll chain 21 now right here through this next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster chain 
chain two through this next uh, two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain two through this next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain two through this next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster. Again I'll chain twenty one. Now through this next this this right there through one chain loop I'll make uh, two double crochet chain one then through that same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet so I'll repeat this throughout row twenty three. At the finish row 23, I'll chain one 21 and right here to the third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 23. Now for row 24, right here to this next double crochet chain, I'll make a slip stitch. Through this next one chain loop, I'll make a slip stitch. I'll chain three. Then through that same one chain loop, I'll make one double crochet. Chain one, then through that same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. Now I'll chain 25. So now that we have chain 25, through this next two chain loop, I'll make a three double crochet cluster. Chain two through this next two chain loop. I'll make three double crochet cluster. Chain two through this next two chain loop. I'll make three double crochet cluster. Again, I'll chain twenty five. Now right here through this next one chain loop I'll make two double crochet. Chain one then through that same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet. I'll repeat this throughout row 24. Now to finish row 24 I'll chain 25 then Then right here through this third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. I thought for a minute that my chain might be twisted, but it wasn't. So this completes row 24. Now for row 25, through this next double crochet chain, I'll make a slip stitch. Through this next one chain loop, I'll make a slip stitch. And then I'll chain three. Now through that same one chain loop, I'll make one double crochet. Chain one, then through that same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. Now I'll chain 28. Now right here through this next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster. I'll chain two, then through this next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster. Again I'll chain twenty-eight. Now 
through his next V-stitch, thread it through it one chain loop. I'll make two double crochet. Chain one, then through the same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. So I'll repeat this throughout row 25. Not finish row 25, I'll chain 28, and right here through this third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 25. Now for row 26, right here through this next double crochet chain, I'll make a slip stitch. Through this next one chain loop, I'll make a slip stitch. Then uh, I will chain three. Then through that same one chain loop, I'll make a one double crochet. Chain one, then through the same one chain loop I'll make two double crochet. Now I'll chain 35. Now right here through the next two chain loop I'll make three double crochet cluster. Again, I will chain 35. So now that I chain 35, after this next one chain loop, right it with V stitch. I'll make two double crochet, chain one, then through the same one chain loop, I'll make two double crochet. So I'll repeat this throughout row 26. So now to finish row 26, I'll chain 35, then right here through this third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. Now I'll chain one and then I'll cut this yarn. We're not done yet. I'm just gonna try to use a different color. I think I said it in this video. I really need to buy some new yarn, especially when I work on the bigger projects. I have to, you know, switch colors very often. Even though sometimes I think it makes the project looks much better, you know, because especially when the colors are contrast. But let's see. So this completes row 26. Right, so, so now for row 27. Right here through this first double crochet chain, I insert my hook, then I insert my hook through a slip knot loop and pull through. Now I'll chain three. Now through this next double crochet chain, I'll make one double crochet. Through this next one chain loop, I'll make one double crochet. Through these next two double crochet chains, I'll make one double crochet through each chain. Now, through these next 35 chains, I'll make one double crochet through each chain. So yeah, we'll just continue making one double crochet through each chain throughout row 27. And where the V-stitches are, we make through the first two double crochet chains, we make one double crochet through each chain, through one chain loop, one double crochet, and through the next two double crochet chains, we make one double crochet through each chain. And then also through these 35 chains, we make one double crochet through each chain. This is gonna be time consuming, so I'm not gonna make this entire row on the camera, but you guys get the idea what 
should be done. So yeah, we just repeat this throughout row 27. Now to finish row 27, right here through this third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 27. Now for row 28, I will chain 3. Then through this next double crochet chain, I'll make one double crochet. Through this next chain, one double crochet. Through the next chain, one double crochet. So, so I'll continue making one double crochet through each chain throughout row 28. And this time around it will be easier because we are only working through our existing chains. So for row 28, just make one double crochet through each chain. So now to finish row 28, right here through this third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 28. Now for row 29, I'll chain 4. Then I'll skip one chain, and through the second chain I'll make one double crochet. Chain one, skip one chain, and through the second chain I'll make one double crochet. Chain one, skip one chain, and through the second chain I'll make one double crochet. Chain one, skip one chain, and through the second chain I'll make one double crochet. Chain one, skip one chain and through a second chain I'll make one double crochet. Chain one, skip one chain and through a second chain I'll make one double crochet. So I'll repeat this throughout row 29. So now to finish row 29, I will uh, chain one, then right here through this third chain I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 29. Now for row 30, right here through this one, next one chain loop I will make a slip stitch. And then I will chain four. Now through this next one chain loop, I'll make one double crochet. Chain one through the next one chain loop, I'll make one double crochet. Chain one through this next one chain loop, I'll make one double crochet. Chain one through the next one chain loop, I'll make one double crochet. Chain one through the next one chain loop, I'll make one double crochet. So we repeat this throughout row 30. Now, to finish, now to finish row 30, I will chain one, and right here through this third chain, I will make a slip stitch. I will chain one, and I'll cut this yarn. Now for row 31, right here through this uh, first one chain loop, I will uh, insert my hook. Then I insert my hook through a slip knot loop and uh, pull through. Now I'll chain three. Then right there through the same loop, I'll make uh, four double crochet. I kind of need five double crochet, but this three chain in the beginning of a row replaces one double crochet. So now we have five double crochet. Now I'll chain four. Now I'll skip these next two one chain loops and right here to this double crochet right here, I will make one single crochet. Again, I'll chain four. I'll skip the next two chains. I'll skip these next two one chain loops and through this third one chain loop, I'll make five double crochet. Again, I'll chain four. Then I'll skip these next two one chain loops. Actually, maybe it will be easier to say this. I'll skip these next two double crochet chains and through this third double crochet chain, I'll make one single crochet. I'll chain four. I'll skip these next two one chain loops and through this third one chain loop, I'll make five double crochet. I'll chain four. Again, 
I'll skip this next two double crochet chains and through this third double crochet chain I'll make one single crochet. Chain four. Now I'll skip these next two one chain loops and through this third one chain loop I'll make five double crochet. So we repeat this throughout row 31. It may be easier to count them. Now to finish row 31 I'll chain 4, then right here through this third chain I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 31. Now for row 32 I'll chain 3. Now through these next 4 chains I'll make 4 double crochet cluster. We kind of need 5 double crochet cluster, but this 3 chain in the beginning already counts as 1. So we have 5 double crochet cluster. Now I will chain 11. Now through these next 5 double crochet chains, I'll make 5 double crochet cluster. Chain 11, through the next 5 double crochet chains I'll make 5 double crochet cluster. So we repeat this throughout row 32. Now to finish row 32, I'll chain 11, then right here through this first double crochet cluster, I'll make a slip stitch. I'll chain 1, then I'll cut this yarn. Now for row 33, right here through this first double crochet cluster, insert my hook and insert my hook through a slip knot loop and pull through. And then I will chain 5. Now I'll skip these next two chains and through this third chain, I'll make one double crochet. Chain 2. I'll skip the next two chains and through this third chain, I'll make one double crochet. Chain 2, I'll skip the next 2 chains and through this 3rd chain I'll make 1 double crochet. Chain 2, I'll skip these next 2 chains and through this 3rd chain I'll make 1 double crochet. Chain 2, I'll skip these next 2 chains and through this 3rd chain I'll make 1 double crochet. Chain 2, I'll skip these next two chains and through this third chain I'll make one double crochet. Chain two. I'll skip these next two chains and through this third chain I'll make one double crochet. Chain two. I'll skip these next two chains and through this third chain I'll make one double crochet. So I'll repeat this throughout row 33. Now to finish row 33, I'll chain 2, then right here through this third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. Chain 1, then I'll cut this yarn. Row 34, Right here through this two chain loop, I insert my hook, then insert my hook through a slip knot loop and pull through. Chain one, then through the same two chain loop, I'll make one single crochet. Now, through this next two chain loop, I'll make five double crochet. I'm planning to make this a last row and see how it turns out. 
Now through this next two chain loop I'll make one single crochet. Through this next two chain loop I'll make five double crochet. Through this next two chain loop I'll make one single crochet. Through this next two chain loop I'll make one single crochet. Through this next two chain loop I'll make five double crochet. Through this next two chain loop I'll make one single crochet. Through this next two chain loop I'll make five double crochet. Through this next two chain loop I'll make one single crochet. So I'll repeat this throughout row 34. Now to finish row 34 right here through this first single crochet chain I'll make a slip stitch. I'll chain one then I'll cut this yarn. Through this next two chain loop I'll make one single crochet. 